Basin Head is famous for a rare species of giant Irish moss, but there are lots of other things to show visitors, to touch and hold, giving them a new appreciation for the ecosystem here. And a lot of the people that come on these tours are from cities and they've never seen anything like this before. And us, living on PEI, we take it for granted. Over the winter, the Surrey Wildlife Group attended sessions on experiential tourism put on by Tourism PEI. They used what they learned to revamp their tours. But we really wanted to add like eating seaweed into it because uh, when we went on the workshops, they're really talking about what natural PEI flavors you can bring to your authentic experience. The wildlife group has spent the last month fine-tuning recipes featuring seaweed. They collected kelp and dulse on nearby beaches and built an outdoor dehydrator to dry the seaweed so it can be cooked. Seaweed is very important. There's a lot of cultures around the world that eat seaweed because of its nutrient benefits. And we wanted to kind of incorporate that into our experience. Today, some young friends are testing out the new seaweed snacks. It's a kind of weird, but it was salty mostly. There is a charge for the Beyond the Beach experiences, $25 for adults, $10 for kids. But that's just to cover their time and expenses. The only purpose we have of this is just to share what a beautiful place this is and let people know more about Basin Head. The tours will be offered twice a week from now until the end of August. Nancy Russell, CBC News, Basin Head.